Hey guys, welcome back to Thousand Tear. Today I'm going to be talking about Sonic's design for the 2019 Sonic film, as two images were leaked out uh, covering his design, actually. Um, yeah, this is, it would be exciting news if it wasn't how, for how bad his design is. Fucking Christ, kill it with fire. So, um, yeah, first image is basically a big, yeah, bunch of different images. It looks like a slideshow, if anything, so, I don't know, I think it's a movie, I think it was worded as, like, some type of movie film thingy, I don't know, I was, I'm just gonna call it a PowerPoint, it's just, like, about PowerPoint slides and shit, okay, um, it covers a bunch of, it has a bunch of different things, like, one's, like, a total contents, obvious thing, like, a picture, it looks like, I don't know, an image, which has Sonic's full design, um, some other ones, some that are cut off a bit, one covers like his personality and shit, which really couldn't care because it should, it's going to. Uh, I'm worried. I'll worry about that when I actually watch the film. Something about toys, of course, merchandise, and even money, of course. Some and yeah, other things about that. Mostly the design is the big thing here. So um, let's just get right into his design. Um, I'm gonna start off with what good things I like about the design, or things I'm indifferent about. Uh, that's, I think it would be good to start out great and then delve into the shit. Okay? So, um, yeah, his design. Um, I like the shade of blue for his fur. Um, I reckon it, it's a nice fur, but blue. It's a nice blue. It's it's Sonic. Um, yeah. Um, uh, I like... Um, yeah, I don't... I don't. That's about it. I, I only like the fact that he's... The shade of blue for his fur, and nothing else really appeals to me. I mean, the fact that he's, yeah, he is, like, furry, like, he's actually got fur, really isn't a big, a big deal to me. I, I was expecting that, I mean, if, when you have a live-action CGI film, and you turn, uh, CGI characters are generally, for the most part these days, gonna have furry, yeah, fur, and shit like that, so... That does doesn't bother me, but yeah, other than that, the fact that he's that it's a nice shade of blue and he's furry. That's about it. That's about all I can like about this. About all I can like about it. The rest I do not like. So uh, let's just let's just go into this. Um, first off, his eyes. Let's just, let's just kill the uh, complete glaring elephant in the room. His goddamn eyes. Uh. Yeah, he's got really fucking small eyes. They, they're little fucking... Yeah, they're really little and they're separated. Like, he actually has two different eyes. Which, actually, which, to be fair, granted, is more realistic. But it is not Sonic. It is so weird to look at him like that. Like, god damn. Yeah, they're too little. Like, when you look at this, granted, it's not... The worst it could be, I mean, I was worried he was going to have, like, actual hedgehog eyes, which I was worried about, yeah, because during, when I looked at the silhouette in the teaser trailer, it looked like he was going to have actual hedgehog eyes, which terrified me, but they didn't do that, they gave him white and green eyes, which is somewhat som sonic, but they still don't look right, I don't know how else to word it, um, and what's worse is that in some of the images, um, yeah, it looks like they are like the kind of goggle shape instead of the, um, yeah, separated, but it's really weird. Like, when some it looks like they're separated, some they don't. It really is like, it's, uh, it's really weird. And his eyes are really small as well. So, yeah, um, yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> um, what's else? Um, his, yeah, his, his legs and arms, we'll go with that, um, yeah, they've got muscles, granted, uh, his arms are not that muscly, but you can still tell that they're a bit more thicker than, they're more thicker than, yeah, his, no his more, yeah, the norm his normal design, as you know, they've got, his normal arms are generally noodle-like, which are more sunny, these look, yeah, they look too beefy. It's not, not super beefy, but it's just a bit beefy enough where to the point where I notice and I don't like it. But his legs, oh god, yeah. 
they did not fix his legs up that much. Um, yeah, he's got, he's got, some, he, he did not skip out on leg day. Jesus Christ, he has muscles, and I, I, I get it. Okay, I get it, Power Man. He, he's a fast hedgehog. He runs a lot. He's gonna have, yeah, he's gonna be strong in the legs, but you don't need to give him muscles in the legs. I mean. We know that Sonic's fast. Everyone, if you know Sonic the Hedgehog, you'll know his main his main thing is he runs fast. You don't need to emphasize that on giving him beefy ass legs. I mean, Sega have learnt this lesson with yeah, Knuckles and his Sonic Boom design. I mean, we all know that Knuckles is strong, but in Boom they gave him beefy ass fucking arms. And yeah, no and. Not many people really like that. Does like that the idea of Knuckles having beefy ass arms? We didn't need. Yeah, you don't need to always make a character look strong. Yeah, uh, you. Know, though, how do I word this? You don't need to make a character who is strong look strong. I mean, yeah, Knuckles was already known for being very strong, but he had noodle arms like all the other characters. In Boom. All the other characters do have still the noodle arms, except him. He has beefy ass, like fucking Hulk arms, and it's weird. It, it, it felt unnatural. That's kind of what, like, yeah, Sonic's legs are. Yeah, he's yeah. We get Sonic can run fast and shit, and he uses and he sh would ha yeah. You expect him, his him to not have noodle legs and run that fast, but he does anyway. But in this case, I just gave him muscles. I, I don't I don't like that. I, it is, it, it's creepy to look at him having m muscly legs. Um, yeah, um, he's, yeah, uh, he's, you know, in general his proportions are just wrong. Like, his head and body are about okay with proportions, like his head should be a tiny bit bigger to fit, yeah, his body. And his body is, does have the general kind of bean, sh bean shape, like, yeah, Sonic usually does, but... His arms and legs are too thick, and I'll go to onto the feet and hands. Like Jesus Christ, his feet and hands are small as fuck. Okay, and that's not right because that's it. Seems really weird. His feet, I can kind of get over. Like, him having smaller feet than usual, that's not a big issue. I, I can slightly live with that. I don't like it, but I can live with it slightly. Um, I have a different problems with his feet, but I'll come to that in a moment. His hands, though. Fuck, what have I done with his hands? They are small as fuck. Like, Jesus, God, they are small as fuck. And, yeah, like, is, is, yeah, they're like, it's like actual human hands on, yeah, on human arms, which does not fit Sonic well. Sonic is known for having beef, yeah, noodle arms and big hands. The same goes for his legs and feet. Noodle legs, big feet. And it just looks unnatural. And and then now let's get to his at is what he's wearing, his shoes. Uh yeah. It doesn't look like it now, but actually in the second image I'm gonna be showing you in a moment, um he actually, his shoes actually have like a white tick on him. Reminiscence, reminiscence of Nike, yeah, you know, Nike shoes. So yeah, um, I'm, I have a feeling that Nike is sponsoring Paramount to get, yeah, his, yeah, their shoes onto Sonic. And yeah, I don't like that. The only thing that you can tell their Sonic shoes is that they're red with white bottoms. That's it. I don't like that. Um, and, and then his gloves, Ooh, gloves, as I'll call them. Uh, they do not look like gloves. They look like actually a part of his hand. Like they are, they are his hands. They're not gloves. They are his hand. Cause in some of the images, it looks like that. Yeah, it's kind of like yeah, like a part of him. It's part of his fur. It, it, it's hard to notice in these images, but in the second image I'm going to be showing you, it will make more sense. So the second image is well I'm covering is gonna help without more this is gonna help you guys understand what I'm talking about with his his like shoes and gloves. Um yeah, this second image actually is more of a movie render actually. So this is what Sonic more than likely will look like exactly in the film. Yeah, it looks still looks bad. 
Um, yeah, his eyes are much more separated as well. Like, it is creepy to look at. See, um, so your shoes, you can look right there that you have, it has a white tick, boom, white tick, and Nike, I have a feeling that Nike is sponsoring, um, the, yeah, is a sponsor or has a, 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 a sponsor, a deagle of some kind with Paramount to make Sonic wear the, his, their shoes. I don't like that. Uh, Sonic's also not wearing socks, which is really weird. It looks just wrong. But as you can see, look at his hands. Do you see, yeah, you can see now what I mean by his gloves. Gloves. I mean, his hands, you can see that it's kind of fur. It's like, it looks like it's actually just a part of him. And it looks awful. Yeah, it's one thing to, yeah, if, if they were not going to give him gloves, I would have rather he just get, they gave him just blue hands. Having, yeah, blue arms. And then there's a patch of, yeah, white or skin or whatever color that is. Yeah, just to cover his hands is so unnatural. You either go all the way, you either give him his, all, his whole arms make him skin, or you give him blue, all blue hands to go with the blue arms. Or, you know, you could just, you know, give him gloves. This, this design is... Sorry. The only thing that Sonic is that his body is kind of the body, the normal shape of Sonic, and his head has his quill shape. Everything else is just wrong. It's, 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 it's just so, so unnatural. I mean, it's, it, this, this creature, this is, this is a creature, okay? It's, this is a creature. If you were to look at this, like, you, you just wanna, you just wanna, like, put it out of its misery. Looking at this design, as I've said, is this absolutely cancer. And I don't, and it just seems so wrong. Like, apparently though, this is the most realistic thing. This is how realistic, what Sonic would look realistically in real life if it was possible. However, it, not even 24 hours after these were leaked, this, these new images were leaked, someone actually came up with fan art recreating it and they did a actually a really good job so it's just so yeah as you can see so yeah just covering his things um yeah the design of this yeah of the fan version actually is actually sonic for one actually the only difference is it has yeah the, yeah the fur color yeah basically that's that actually the fur color it, and, and, and it still and it looks like it'd fit I mean, why can't Paramount do what Detective Pikachu are doing? Yeah, the P the Pokemons are more furry, and to make them uh, only look more furry, to make them look more realistic. But that's it. They've made the Pokemon look like Pokemon. And I've said, I think I said this before in my other video. But god, god damn, a, a fan can outdo you, and I think that's the second time. Because I think in my original, in the teaser trailer uh, video I covered, I uh, did, um, some fan actually recreated the poster, but made made the actual Sonic look like Sonic. And now a fan's done it a second time, with the actual design fully shown. Like, God damn it, Paramount! Why can't you, can't you see that people want, yeah, don't like your design? Well, actually, that's that's actually false. Some people actually do like your design for some goddamn reason. There are people out there who actually find say the design is all right. It's okay. They can live with it. And that's and I think and I think I saw someone say this, um, make yeah, a comment about this, saying that when yeah that due to the yeah the bad reception that the teaser trailer got. Everyone's expectations of the design were so low that now that we've got this design, people were, yes, expectations were so low, but this is just being slightly better than the actual teaser trailer. Because, to be fair, it actually is slightly better due to the fact that the eyes are not actually hedgehog eyes, and I'm going to admit that. But that's about as far as it goes for me. But due to the fact that the expectations were so low for the Sonic's design, that, yeah, that people actually are okay with this due to the fact that it was 
slightly higher than what they expected, which is not that much to be fair, but they can live with it. And and people and this has gotten people mixed. So you'll have people who actually like this design, people who don't like this design, me for one of them, and then you got people who are okay with it, like they can live with it. And it really bugs me because honestly, this design is not okay. Like, if you do like the design, okay, good for you, um, but I don't, and I don't think I'll ever will. It is not, it's not going to grow on me. I hated his design in the teaser trailer, and I hate his design still now, even when looking at his full thing. The only thing I can say they actually improved was his eyes. His eyes don't look like actual hedgehog eyes, which, thank fuck for that. But, yet, yeah, no, it's, this design is not okay, okay? <laughs> It is not. It, it, it's just bad. I mean, Paramount, it's just time to stop. It, it, it's just not, this is not okay. I mean, God damn it. And there's actually another thing I want to show you guys. Um, Yuji Naka, the, create, the person who created Sonic, actually responded to the design. Now, he read it, he, since Yuji Naka is actually is Japanese, he made a tweet. Um, in Japanese and someone translated it for us and it reads that yeah Yuji Naka said that seeing this Sonic's full visual I realize that the proportion of head and body and the roundness of your body are important it's could couldn't they uh, are important couldn't they balance them out a bit better now if you yeah this might not see you might not understand what he's meaning but basically what he's saying is that he doesn't like the design which is fair enough, because he was the one who came up with Sonic's original design. This is the guy that made Sonic who he is today. He, without him, Sonic would not be a hedgehog. He'd be something god un un else. He wouldn't even be Sonic. And Yuji Naka is disappointed. Sega already, were, Sega and Sonic team already didn't like the design, pa the way Paramount were going with the design back when we had the teaser trailer come out. Sega were not happy with it, and now you got Yuji Naka of all fucking people saying they don't like it. Paramount, you obviously can't take a hint. The, the design is bad. You, you might wanna. You, and it's too late to fix it now. I think. Like, the movie comes out this year. It comes out in November. That's only a few months away. That's like half a year away. I don't think he, they, I, like, I would love for them to change the design, but unfortunately I don't think they have the time to. They're going to want to push this out as quickly as possible so they can get more money. This is, that's all they worry about, that, the money. Uh, fuck me. This thing should not be around. This thing is just bad. Like, this thing, it put this thing out of its misery, like, god damn. Oh, this this thing is this poor child, this poor thing is gonna yeah he is not he is this is not okay I don't know how many ways this, this is fools me I don't know what to say I, I've lost comprehension of what I want to say but god damn this thing is bad and you might say oh it's not that bad but it it is okay it, it is you can't convince me otherwise it's saying this is not bad this is okay this is this is not okay okay. It's, it's not okay. I don't like it. I mean, that, it's not. It's not okay. I mean, the only thing I'm okay with is the shade of blue that he is. And that's about it. His, his legs and arms are too muscular. His feet and hands are too fucking small. His eyes, fuck, they're way too small and it's actually separated like Jesus Christ and it's, it's just no it, it, the rest of it is like yeah and it also his tail where the fuck's his tail I, I got I, 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 that's another thing I just I just realized that he doesn't really have a tail I look at some of the images I just realized I couldn't really find a tail if it's there it's so small that I couldn't really fucking notice it God damn. Oh god, this gives me an aneurysm. This gives me an aneurysm. I don't And the fact that people actually like this is dumbfounded to me, but again, that's their opinion. They're allowed to like this design. 
It doesn't mean it just because, but and I gotta respect that. But it doesn't mean I need to agree with them. All right, and I don't like this design, and that's fine. If you and if you like this design, that's fine too. But I don't. And that's not gonna. I'm not gonna change my mind. You can't convince me otherwise that this is a good design. This is an okay design. This is livable. It's not. <laughs> it is not to me. It is not. I. I, this is not okay. This, this abomination needs to be taken out of the back and just shot in the head. God damn it. Uh, it, it, it this it, it is, and it's not, it's not, and that sounds brutal, but we'll be doing it a favor. We're putting it down for its, yeah, to put it out of its misery. Fuck me. God damn it. Like, God, this, this thing's not okay. I don't know how many times I can say it. Like, for it to, to cover quickly what it, I don't like about it. It's basically the proportions of his head, body, arms, legs, all that shit. His eyes, is is just no. It's it's, 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 a, it's not much to cover on his design either. It's a simple design, and they fucked it up. It, it's just it's just, it's just wrong. I don't like it. It getting of course. His shoes had to be Nike shoes, so it's, they've obviously got a partnership deal or some shit. So. Uh, you can't convince me otherwise, I mean, why, otherwise, if they didn't have a, partner, a partnership deal, they might as well gave him actual Sonic shoes. They weren't, now, thinking about it, Power Man probably wouldn't have done that anyway, because that's not realistic. Who gives a shit if it's realistic? How about you, instead of going realism, go with sticking true to what the fucking thing is. Is Sonic, is Sonic's not Sonic anymore, Sonic is a furry. What's makes Sonic actually stand out from other anthropomorphic characters is his proportions. Sonic has been known for having very large heads. Uh, Sonic characters are known for having very large heads, very large hands, very large feet, noodle arms, noodle legs, and bean-shaped bodies that are much smaller than his, uh, which are much smaller than his head. And that's pretty much the general gist of Sonic proportions. Uh, anthropomorphic characters, other anthropomorphic characters, especially furry characters, generally are just animals with human proportions. That's what makes Sonic different. And what you've got here, well, it's not exactly furry, a furry proportion, which is all human parts on a, on a with an, an animal with basic human proportions. You've got something that's about midway. Which has created this abomination. I, I don't know how much else I can cover. I mean, I've covered everything I need to. I mean, this, I mean the design is shit. Uh, the actual movie render scares me because that's what I'm going to be seeing when I watch the movie and what people are going to watch. The kids are going to watch this. Do you really think that kids are gonna go look at this and think this is actually cool or adorable? No, they're gonna. This is gonna give them nightmares. Hey, like, god damn it! It's like that. It's not gonna be known for being a child's film. It's gonna be known for being a, a slight horror film, monster film. Like, god damn it! This thing's an abomination. But yeah, basically, I don't like the design. Sega don't like the design. The people, the fans, are kind of mixed about the opinions on the design. Yuji Naka does not like the design. I, what else can I say about it that hasn't already been said? <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. If you enjoyed this video, remember to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. And I'll talk to you guys later.